Hey everyone, my name is Justin Anchetta from Soul Graffiti Productions and I'm just doing a little ukulele intro once again at the Public Library in Grass Valley, California on this Saturday, December 21st from 5 to 6 p.m. And for people that have been there before, I always introduce something new. Um, if you're intermediate or even advanced, there's ways of playing new patterns, um, strumming and plucking both kind of keep those people progressing on their path and then also people coming in brand new to the ukulele. Um, today, on this little demonstration, I'm gonna do something that's kind of advanced. Um, it's a montuno. Um, I've been doing tres playing. It's an it's a Afro-Cuban instrument that's kind of rare in the States. Um, and I was wondering how I could bring it onto the ukulele. Um, and what I've been doing is playing the C chord and then a G7. So C being the one chord, the root chord, and then G7 being the five, five chords up, right? C, D, E, F, G. G7, right? And what I'm doing here is a montuno often is played around the downbeats. Um, I will put a little tablature on this so that you can kind of see it on a piece of paper while you play along. So if you're not getting this rhythm right away, go easy and take your time because this is kind of complex because it's not just doing the down strums or doing a plucking exactly on one and two and three and four and just the eighth notes. It's syncopated around that on the sixteenth notes. So this is how it goes right here. What I'm doing is I'm using these three fingers, P, I, and M, primo, indio, medio. And I'm doing a plucking pattern that is together, and then the pattern of together on the P and the M finger, and then I'm going M, I, P, right? So following through, M, I, P. M, I, P, M, I, P, M, I, P. Together, I, P. M, I, P, M, I, P, M, I, P, together, right? So the together is kind of your, your downbeat, and every other note is syncopated around the count of four, right? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Right, so nothing's really playing on the two, three, four. It's kind of syncopated around that. A lot of montunos are doing that. Um, it's very rare, actually, that the one is played so strongly by that. Sometimes it's the four, the and of four, or the E. And so what we're doing here is just the basic pattern of M, I, P, M, I, P, M, I, P, M, I, P. And um, it's really hard to count and play that because it's so syncopated. Uh, the goal is that your P finger is out in front as best you can so that it doesn't get in the way of your I and M finger. And you're actually um, coming back and forth on the third and fourth string, right? Fourth string being the top one and third being just down below. Your thumb, your P finger is changing back and forth, right? And your M and I finger stay respectively on strings one and two. So I'll play one more time for you guys, and I hope you guys can join the Grass Valley Workshop at the Public Library December 21st from 5 to 6 p.m. And it's free. Just go ahead and call the library to register or email soulgbooking at gmail.com. S-O-U-L-G-B-O-O-K-I-N-G at gmail.com. Here we go.
Easy as that. The one and the five, and the five being that seven, G7 instead. Very common for Montunos on the tres and the ukulele. Cheers.